A Wolcott school board's decision to allow a student to wear an anti-gay t-shirt has many of you sounding off tonight. And some of you are commenting on a special piece we ran uh, Tuesday about the AR-15 rifle. Here's tonight's Voice of the People. I saw the piece on the AR-15 and it was educational. The only thing that wasn't mentioned was that the gun can be made into an automatic. A friend of mine had one and he did convert it into an automatic. This was years ago, but I'm sure the technique is still the same. It's a good gun, but it doesn't belong in the streets. I've worked in public education my entire life as an openly gay person. About the boy who wants to wear an anti-gay shirt, I think that's fine. We've had a long history of freedom in America. We're free to wear anti-gay shirts, swastikas against Jews, Confederate flags against black people. And what I believe is that Americans are fair-minded. The rest of us see the message of hate, and then we're the ones who take the appropriate action. Where do we draw the line? There should be absolutely nobody in any school system that should be allowed to wear something to school that is against anybody. We're all equal. We live in this world as equal, and we're teaching diversity. On a pouring rain day, now they're plowing the snow on the corners of East Main Noble and, and Boston Avenue. I don't understand that. You know, when we needed the serious help, there was no one there to help. Now that it's ultimately going to turn to slush and melt by the end of the day.